because he has a hair appointment but I ate a couple hours ago I'm hungry I don't want to lift when I'm hungry so what am I eating I try to go for carbs and not fats so I was like shit I have literally nothing because we don't really buy snack food Oreo O's cereal is honestly a lot better than you think it is because this has for 30 grams 1.5 fat 25 carbs fucking awesome pre-workout so mm. this is my childhood cereal i used to eat a bowl a day no more than a bowl almost a box a day i'm not kidding when i was a kid right when, right after school come home and have like three bowls so i'm gonna eat this and we'll see you at the gym i don't have anyone to film me so i'm gonna do my best see you there bye upper body day at the gym 1mr finally had this back in my life it's been so long my favorite pre-workout it hits me faster when I just take it straight to the face. And I don't usually do it, but I've been doing it lately. So I'm gonna do a whole scoop, I think. delicious it's so good watermelon I love it okay I'm gonna go in there real quick to try to catch bra to try to catch bra I can't I can't even put this top on oh my god it's these nails I'm not used to this um what is this for this is my top where the fuck did I get that? I don't know where that came from. Okay. We're gonna go to the gym now. I'm gonna try to videotape it by myself. We'll see how good I do. Bye. Yeah, you sing all these other imitators. Don't let the only real one to me taste ya. See you watching down run out of time now.
one that hit that same spot She the one that bring the range out yeah. We go back, remember, crisscross and hopscotch You the one that hold me down when the block's hot I make your dreams come true when you wake up And your looks just the same without no makeup Had to pull up on your mama, see what you made of Ain't got no worry about it Workout's done, couldn't film it because it was just hard to do on my own. Got some so in there. You got some when Brian was there and a little bit of what I could do. You pretty much saw my shoulder workout and then I did back, a little bit of back after. I will put the whole workout in the description box, but right now we are on our way to the little Main Street of Delray Beach, Atlantic Ave, to get some poke post workout. I it is almost four o'clock and I've only had breakfast, so I'm fucking hangry. Like really bad. I'm fucking starving. Who doesn't eat? I'm just hungry. So I will show you what I get at poke and I will put the macros on the screen for you, what I estimate them to be. I have a better idea of what poke now, um, the macros are since I made my own poke bowl last weekend. So much more fat in those bowls than I really thought. So I will show you what I do, what I ask for. I have no, I, we've never been to this place. It's new, I think. So I will show you what I get and what I log for it. Do you, do you know how much, say if I got the Aki tuna poke bowl, how much Aki tuna you put on it or you just, you have no idea? Um, well, it's portion. Oh, it is, okay. So, it's a good amount. Do you know the portion or not? Okay, I track all my food. Okay. So yeah, I yeah, just, I you do? Okay, okay, so I'm just that annoyed. Yeah. And what about the rice? Do you even, do you know a ballpark of how much, like a cup of rice? I mean, like, yeah, you always ask the chef. Oh, that's awesome. Like, exactly. How much Aki tuna is in the um, poke bowls? Yeah. Six or eight ounces? Four ounces? Okay, I was going to say six or eight, but not. Yeah. Um, okay, cool. I think I'll just do that. I'll do a poke bowl, Aki tuna. You'll be eating the food all the time. Yeah. Because, like, every day, when, like, for the closing shift, I'll, like, get something to get ready, and then I'll, like, go home and eat it, and I'll be like, literally all I eat. Yeah. Have yeah, you guys eaten anything? All right, thank you very much. We just had a poke bowl. Each of us got a poke bowl. And then, believe it or not, I have never had a acai bowl ever because they're super high in fat and carbs and so I always avoid them. But they had mini ones. So Brian and I shared the like protein one that they had. And that was really good and they showed us so okay i wanted to tell you guys what i do for like logging in my fitness pal for these meals and i have no shame so i asked the girl who was cashing us out to ask the chef how much rice and ahi tuna they use in their bowls and they are more than willing and more than happy to accommodate so they told me that it's pre-packaged ahi tuna four ounces so that I logged that and then they don't weigh out the rice or anything so I looked at it and I like to overestimate because there was like you know slaw and other stuff that are carbs in the bowl so I just logged six ounces of rice of sushi rice because that's what was in it and then I logged one and a half tablespoons of sriracha mayo and for the acai bowl, I just searched for acai bowl and there was one in my fitness pal that showed a small. So I just logged that. Um, even though I split a mini one, I like to overestimate because there was toppings on it and there's a lot of fruit. So um, yeah, that's what I logged for my lunch today. I, yeah, that's it. <laughs> Brian's shaking his head at me. I don't know why. Because you're so cute. Because I'm so cute. So we are walking down 
downtown Delray Beach, Atlantic Ave. There are shops and stuff. We're just gonna digest and take a little walk, just probably up and down the main strip. And then we'll go home and watch Alice in Wonderland. Hell yeah, I can't wait. Just got back from Trader Joe's. Didn't bring my camera in with me because I forget, babe, I always forget to bring my camera with me. So I'm gonna show you what I got. I'm gonna make a snack even though I'm not hungry right now. It's six o'clock and I've only had breakfast and my post-workout meal. So it's gonna be like just a fun little night of eating. So for my snack that I'm gonna have right now, I got watermelon, yikama. Yikama for 85 grams is seven carbs and it tastes like a really mellow carrot. So yikama, watermelon, sprinkled on top, chili lime seasoning. You can think I'm weird but you love all my recipes, you're gonna love this. 170 grams of yakima. They're like little sticks. And watermelon spears. Oh my God, these packages. So the spears are in, oh my God, these are huge. Really big chunks. I want it to match, kind of. I want it to be like this size. Cutting them in two pieces like that. So now that I have this all weighed, I'm just gonna cut them into pieces like that to match the rest of the yipama. One well, tinier, I think. 29 carbs for this whole bowl. Zero fat, zero fat and three protein. So low fat for, I mean, 29 carb, you could eat half of this serving and be like for a snack. And if you're in like a snacky mood, that's freaking awesome. And this stuff, chili lime seasoning, I'm telling you. Telling you. On watermelon, they were sampling it a couple months ago at Trader Joe's with the watermelon, and it was so good. And the chili lot or yakima is just kind of plain, so I knew that it would take on this flavor really well. It's like salty, and like the lime is like super limey, super limey, super limey, super limey. Okay, now I'm just gonna mix it and try to get the seasoning on everything. When I eventually, I'm gonna just sit down here so you guys can see my face. When I eventually go on prep, if I do, every time I say, okay, right now, since I'm not on prep, obviously, I say I'll be on prep, but I've said I'm gonna compete for years now, like literally for years now, and I never do because I'm a scaredy cat and posing scares me. I don't care. All you competitors out there who tell me, oh, you got this. I'm scared. This will not focus. I'm gonna just gonna take my head out. There we go. I think my camera won't focus. Oh my God. Mm -mm -mm. something that's gonna make these, this even better, this snack. One second, please. This ingredient is gonna make this even better. A lime, lime juice. <laughs> with the yakima especially, but then with the watermelon, this little bit of lime juice, yes. Did you just sniff me? No, I just went to like get in the shop. Oh, I thought you slipped. I know the fans like to see guest appearances here. Oh yeah. Yummy, yummy, yummy. That is so good. 
oh my god it looks so tasty and it really really is it's refreshing it has a kick from the seasoning but not too spicy the lime from the lime juice and the seasoning it's so good and so refreshing and crunchy perfect summertime snack right here this is a huge bowl i mean honestly huge so 29 carbs three fat zero fat three protein if you had half of this serving so one serving of yakima and a hundred grams of watermelon it would be 14 fat why do i keep saying fat 14 carbs jesus christ i'm gonna go snack on this i'm really looking forward to it and we're gonna go watch alice in wonderland we're watching the first one and the second one today bye I'm taking you guys upstairs to see the bedroom. Um, and Brian said I don't. No. Brian said no. It's your best interest. It's in my best interest. <laughs> to not show you guys what our bedroom looks like because it's poly. Well, when Bailey jumps around, everything like comes off the bed. The bed is in shambles right now because Bailey like does like these crazy like rounds where she's like running all over the place on the bed. too bad yeah not too shabby so we moved, in July, right? we moved in a month ago and the bedroom is always like the last place that I will like spend time and money on I'd rather do the rest of the house because him and I are the only ones that come in here so we just do like the minimum for now we bought curtains at home goods we, we haven't put them up yet because we need a freaking drill. We need a power drill. Is that what it's called? I don't know. Legs tomorrow. Heavy leg day. I will make it a great workout. And then we have sushi. Our weekly sushi date every Sunday after legs. And then meal prep, which you will see on my IG story. So we're going to start this movie. Hope you liked the vlog. Hope you liked all the recipes, cooking tips, the little bit of the workout that I was able to show you. Um, yeah, if you liked it, I would love it if you subscribed. I would love it if you liked the video, if you liked it. And if you have anything to say, any questions, anything at all, what you wanna see from me, anything, leave it in the comments. And I will see you next time, fam.